Hi, my name is David, and in this video, we're going to break down a simple method that Shopify store owners can use to improve their brand presence. I was doing some research online and I came across this, so I wanted to share it with Shopify store owners out there. So after you've created your website, your Shopify store, you have all your products, your website is launched, everything is good to go. Now you just need customers. I'm sure there's many different ways that, that you might be using to get customers. You might be running ads on TikTok or Instagram. Maybe you're making content. So there's so many things that you can do. But one thing that a lot of times people might forget is the Google search results. Like if you go on Google and you type in something like men's hair brushes, you see that they'll have like search results come up. So let's go an example here. So if we type in men's hair brushes like this, you see immediately these sponsored listings come. These are all people who have their products listed on Google. So when you type in that product, then your product will come up. So how can you actually get about doing this? So what you want to do is you want to go to buy on Google. This is the service or this is the method that allows your products to show up here. Buy on Google. So if you just go on Google, you type in buy on Google, you can come to a page like this. You can read through the stuff and actually how to set this up for your business. So the first thing you want to do is read through the get started just to understand how it works. And then the next step is to set up your account. So I did that here right here so that you can see about how the dashboard looks if you haven't done this before. So it will, really, it will first take you to this page where you have to sign up, connect your Gmail account, do that. But then it'll take you to the overview dashboard. So here you can see the performance of the various listings that you've added. Here's where you're gonna actually add those products that you've had. And so what you do is you can either add them a file, add to a file, or you can add them one by one. So let's say this is our Shopify store here and we have these various oils but we also want somebody when they search on Google for our oils to come up, then we'll come in here and we'll add our products individually. So we'll come in here, we'll maybe add an identifier, kind of like what you can do in Shopify, adding those uh, like identifiers to be able to specify which product it is, the title, brand description. And the best part is you can just take all this from Shopify, copy and paste, copy and paste, so you don't have to spend too long doing this. Maybe you just want to test out a few products at a time just to see how it works. But this is very helpful because once you get this product in and it gets in the system, then when somebody comes and looks up men's hair brushes or whatever product it is that you sell, you can come up here. And by doing this, you can actually increase the amount of time that your product gets seen or your brand gets seen. And even if they click on the product and maybe they don't like that specific product, you, they, you've already gotten into your website. So let's say if you're running Google Ads, now you have them locked in and the next time they see an ad, it'll be from your store and then they can come back. So that's how the whole process works. But this is another way on how you can actually increase visibility on your store. So you can go to buy on Google, learn more about that, set up an account, get your products in the system so you can start increasing the visibility of your product. So I hope this video was a little bit helpful on how you can actually start doing this process. If you have any more questions, if you feel like this is too complicated or too fast, or you feel like you have so many things going on that you don't have time to actually do this for yourself, and you want me to help you to do it, you can come to my website here, zqdo.info. You, you can learn a little bit more about what I do, my services, how I can help you see my past work, book a call. Once again, the website is zqdo.info. Or you can feel free to send me an email. My email is zqdo.tech at gmail.com. Once again, the website, zqdo.tech at gmail.com. So you either come to my website or send me an email and I can see how I can help you get this set up so that you can start increasing and allowing your products to be seen more in different avenues to help you grow your Shopify store. So once again, I hope this video was helpful. And if you have any questions, feel free to reach out.